Licorice knows the information, and now it's up to the P250s. Tabson with a lovely headshot for the well, first. That gets the down. information for the players in Ivy, and they manage to find a three-second frag through Nex. Now it starts to look awkward for Illuminar. They're trying to run away, but Nex is having none of it. Stomp King pushed as well. He'll be found by Xantares. Last man alive is Mono, and Xantares utterly fearless on the corner. See, up close and personal can be absolutely lethal. Nex on low HP. Two frags for Illuminar out of nothing. Tabson desperate to recover the situation. Will just about manage it, but it's two on four. He's being Tabson. pinned in from so many angles at once here. Grabs the first. Knows the flank is an option, but Tabson does have it covered for the time being. Spray's just about good. There's so many tags, though, and Stomp King on that scout is going to be so lethal. He finds one. How does Tabson hit that shot? But the trade is there, and Illuminar. He's going to find a good amount of damage onto Tizian, and he will be frantic. And Rias just goes wandering. Think about their execute. Stomp King behind the barrels. Able to find one Tabson, but near enough immediately traded. And Stomp King's position is still unknown. Two players left for big, and they really have an impossible situation. Finally, Stomp King looks to strike. Nice crossfire again for Illuminar. And half a gap in the smoke. Gifts Innocent the frag. Three seconds left on the clock. And Tizian desperately trying to make something happen. Drops the low ground. Gets one, but traded almost immediately. He's the bomb still. Oscarish lines things up all too it's easily. Too far. He's locked out by the AWP scope. Smooth are found relatively easy by Oscarish. Xantares, no money left in the bank. Stomp King. Xantares this time actually committing to this. Might get caught by the nades. Now Pop flashes him into the open though. Finds the drop to try and find a frag. But Mono catches the timing. He has the nade out. And there we go. Oscarish finds another. That's the bomb out in the open. What can Smooya do? He needs Nex to come up with some kind of a play from in towards Ivy now. But they've got him locked out. Lovely headshot by Nex. Starts to make things viable. Double orbs versus Orp and a Krieg. Three orbs on the server right now as the bomb. Desperate to be recovered. And Stomp King's internet. Down the Stomp King reconnects. And it will be big. Taking their second round on the board. And he's done just that. But the shot gets his position away somehow. He still gets one. Gets the second. And gets the third in the molly. As Turning well. it up a notch here. Looking to set their third round. And Tabson on for the ace now. Needs just one more. And he's hunting it as well. He spots out Mono. He truly spectacular. And there we go. Xantares just going to go straight through the mollies. The smoke puts them out. And now they're looking to purge. How does Tizian hit that headshot? That was pure RNG. Stomp King trades one for one. And manages to drop the bomb in the process. He can call the rotation. And now Innocent chooses to strike from Olaf with a double kill. That's absolutely huge. Four on on two now four on. he's got the awp towards drop but the flank is going to be all too simple and he makes it look very late indeed mono fully blinded tizian has to clear him and can't quite hit the shot though finally traded out by santaris who's looking for the second through the smooth not even interested in getting the bomb down up on top of the train strength to strength four players kept alive they will be in towards a main early on and again innocent's just going to go for a wonder finds himself the opening pick going through it with the pop flash but he's been locked out lovely headshot by innocent for his team. The first target is Riyat's lovely shot, but that gives away the Rotation position. Comes through, though. Lovely shot from Stomp King to take down Smuya, and now it's two on four, and there's so little presence left for Big. The bomb trying to sneak its way in through Tabson, but Nex has gone down, and Tabson, he's only hiding in connector. He's got all the time in the world to rotate back as Riaz takes the fight to big. Finds the first, finds the second as well. Riaz towards E-Box. Absolutely huge as Oscarish gets a third. And again, they're getting torn apart big as the fourth frag goes to Innocent and Smuya. He can't get this one. So much damage done, but yet to find a frag. And Smuya will actually be taken down by Mono initially. Tizian looking to take the fight to the T-side. It's utter chaos, but somehow it's into a three-on-two. With three-on-three with tags onto so many of these. Mono. In a very awkward position indeed. One tap from Xantara's last man alive. He has no idea where to look next. It will be the CT pistol from Big Spawn as well. I don't think Smoothie has any idea at all. That's a freebie. That has Coming got to next here. He has to find frags, but he's looking the wrong way. The backstab is good. Five on three. The scout of Tabson Tizian able to find with the one. timing. Can't win the duel. That's absolutely huge as Innocent gets another. And Innocent not quite able to control the spray, but the collo... And now the push starts to come in towards this A-bomb site. Xantares on the CZ out in no man's land. Next, grabs himself one. Tabson another. Xantares on the CZ gets a third, and it's all on Stomp King. He's overwhelmed. He will be mollied off, but he has Nex in support. This spray down could be so crucial. Big through Xantaris and Tabson and Nex have found Stomp themselves. Goes down to 41. Big, it's just about cleaning things up, but Mono's not done yet. Finds the initial pick to take down Nex. Xantaris the Nex to swing, and somehow he gets another. Looking for more is Mono. He tags. misses the shot, though. He's out on a limb. Stomp King takes it. It's all on Smuya. One on two. The fake flash from the Glock not going to work, though. And Smuya knows there's so many angles to check. He hits the first shot one on one. Stomp King misses it. This is huge. Orp versus Orp. Both just trying to bait each other into this shot. Shoulder peak comes in and Stomp King hits it. Stomp King. Inside. They know they have to be proactive. The 5 7 baits for the Krieg as it finds an opening pick. And the Krieg's lined up beautifully to find more here. He will get the second. Stomp King, the next target. And Tizian with the triple kill. Like train mono. 
takes the contact, but Zantaris has got the better of him. And the last man alive is innocent on 12 HP. That's the awaiting crosshairs of Smuya and Tizian. Can they hit the shots? Lovely initial pick from Smuya. Tizian swings with one more. Mono at the very least gets one on that CZ, but he needs to pick up a rifle. And indeed, he's got himself the AK-47. The bomb a little bit isolated. This player making his way down the ramp, but there we go. Zantaris finds the shot, and the last man alive Stuff is for the Rhea. T side. They were so, so close, but now big draw ever closer to OT. Rotations come through. Illuminar desperately trying to make something happen. Oscarish able to find one onto Tizian. That starts to open things up, but Smuya finds one before he's traded out. Three on three now as the push starts to come in. Tabson finding so many frags, but Mono still keeping his team now, in the Tabson, game. Tabson, they have no idea he's here. Zantares finds one. It's all on stomp. One on two. He's been spotted out, but he hits the shot. He takes down Zantares. One on one now. Tabson versus Stomp King, and he's done it. Illuminar steal map one away. That's a... Support through next. He looks to swing, and it's actually a loop back around. Next hits the early shot, and Smuya, he spied out a lot of presence there. Lovely one tap for the first, but can't quite find the second as Riyats trades him down, and now... ...to try and enable them to get back into the site as through the hut comes Zantares, and a lovely one tap to take the head off of Riyats initially. Dink. We'll give it away as well. Second headshot for Zantares, and Tabson just cleans up. ...out with the AUG, but... It's not quite going to work, and Tabson gets a great timing to pick up the first frag onto Stomp King. Traded one for one, though, as innocent. the minds of big, but it will be the A site hit. Tizian and Nex in perfect position to shut this one down. An initial frag goes the way of Nex, and now the flanks come in. Tizian gets one, Smuya grabs another, and that is out. This is going to be all about the timing, and Tabson gets it through the edge of the molly. Tabson grabs the second, drops the bomb as well, and he's, he's looking push to push too far at all. He's just waiting for his timing, and another frag as Zantares takes down Ostrich. Finally, Mono able to chime in with one, and actually grabs the second Very as well. Indeed, a minute left on the clock as they look to execute in towards this a bomb site lovely shot by innocent trading instantly by next but there we go mono with the headshot one on one smooth versus mono has been not get... that that matters against the awp in the 1v1 and it's all about the shot now who gets the timing smooth covering the right hand side hits the shot it was innocent the he will get a decent amount of tag damage down to 17 he goes but still the flick is on and he finds the first looking for more there's half a gap in that smoke he needs to keep that advantage for his team lovely flashbang but again not quite connecting with the shot and he may be punished now the aggression is getting a little bit too much but tabson pushes causing havoc baiting so much away from them as zantaris finally swings to find the first oscarish last man alive nothing he can do five to nothing he's looking for the opening pick and smoother aggressive again but oscarish has actually read it this time and he spotted the foot out as well how does smoother win they are that? starting to feel confident in their own abilities. Innocent able to find one though. Taking down Zantara. I think that potentially outside was an issue. Tabson looking to correct that very rapidly with a swift the angle. And now he can start to press the issue. The double peak comes in. But the Krieg is so good at dealing with these. He finds the first. Can't quite grab the second as Mono's there to trade. But Tizian once again in the perfect place with the perfect timing. Last man alive is Stomp King on the AWP as he grabs the first. He has no idea where these two CT players are. The flank is good from next. He'll find the frag seventh. Absolutely, close of a swing and a lovely pick to take Not down Riyaz. Any of these opening duels. Nothing they do is working. Finally, Innocent able to find one, but near enough immediately. Tabson swings to take him out. Well, swings wide and takes the early tag, takes the head off. At the very least, starts to make you believe, but that bomb is out in the open and next with such a great position. The spray down's good for one. It's all on Stomp King. Nothing he. Oscarish holding for the CT aggressions as next finds one, but the trade's finally starting to pan out and it's all on Smoothia. Three on one as he finds the opening one. pick. Illuminar have no idea where he is. Oscarish is a freebie stomp. The last man alive and Smuya has done it. Ten to nothing. Smuya clearly feeling confident. Goes for the early peek in towards trophy room. But Tizian's done it all himself. A double kill towards the A bomb site. And the trade's again so, so efficient on the CT side. It leaves Mono and Innocent to try and recover the situation. Mono finds one before he's traded out by Tabson. And Absolutely perfect. He hears Zantara's dropping down, but... I think the two of them, they have everything locked out. Santares spamming through, actually Mashing loses the... Get big, the 11-0 start. Mono clears it, and Mono finds the clutch. Finally, Illuminar gets something. Needs to try and work their way into this round. Fast play towards Squeaky early on, but the spray is so good from the box. And Santares almost catches the time. But now he will. The spray down's good for the second. They're running out of time. 40 seconds left on the clock, and they're running out of manpower as Santares takes down Stomp Such King. A nice just... angle for Tizian as well. The crossfires are so, so good. Tizian grabs one. It's a flawless round from Big. Goodbye for Illuminar. But again, the early pressure, the early trades of damage. And Antares gets caught with a nade out. Ostrich finally able to find his team an opening pick. There's a good amount of damage here. I think we might be on for a 13-2 scoreline. But Tizian not done with it Makes yet. his way down to the B-bomb site. Lovely communication for Smuya to find the refrag. Ostrich goes down. What's Havoc off? and Smuya doing the exact same. Next finds the headshot. Tizian finds another. And of course, Smuya start to find a couple of tags. Perhaps trying to find some kind of damage. And down the ladder they go. He has to find multiple frags here. He hits the first headshot. Can he find the second? No, he can't. Smuya trades it almost immediately. And Ostrich out in no man's land is found by Next. 
Innocent down into the vents. One tap from Tabs, and the last man alive is Stomp King, but he'll only find one onto Smooth. Yeah, it's already on the flank, and I think he's just been spotted out. Next through the smoke, finds the frag. That wall, and Big with control in the five on four. Oscarish looks to level him and are clean out of this site. First, it's Antares, but he's spotted out by the M4 of Mono before the trade comes in. Three on three now. Big are doing such a good job of dismantling the CT defense, and they're trying to get the bomb down and planted. Smooth, though. Turns his back at the worst possible time through Tabson. And next has to do a lot here. Finds himself the first. He's trying to cover the bomb plant, but the timing is good for Stomp King. It's all on Smooya. One on D1s and Stomp King could be an easy initial frag. The spray not quite there. He adjusts and finds it. One versus one. Oscarish spotted out coming through the doors. Takes the tag down to 66. And Smooya knows it's all on him. And he finds the headshot. Big take map number two. They take... Now he starts to spam away. He's trying to buy time as they swarm onto the B-bomb site. Hits a lovely headshot. Nex has got the second. Nex has got his back covered. Finally goes down. And now the short flank from Smuya gets one. Gets the second as well with a one tap. And it's all on Stomp King. Nothing he can... Trying to push that Thanos into a viable position. But he's had his head ripped off. Now the flank from Zantares gets two. And next up on Ninja, this is all about which angles they check. Do they check the close one? They don't. There's one. He's looking for more. Spamming through the wood. Next has got a second. That is huge. Last man alive in Rayat's able to get one at the, the rotation of Tizian to come in. He's out in the open, and that's a beautiful headshot from Rayat. Isolating the 1v1s, and does he spot Tizian making his way up? I don't think he's seen him yet. The drop down will give it away, of course, and Tizian's actually in the window. This is all about the timing. Rayat does his head appear. It does, and a lovely shot off the angle, but he has to find this initial shot. The trade, not quite there. Rayat gets the opening pick, and now three on five as the push comes in. Lovely flashbang. 18 seconds left on the clock. Big can just play for the bomb denial here, and Tabson knows it. Tizian gets a one for one, and now in towards Sandwich. The frags all of a sudden go the way of Big, and it's down to two on two, two on one. Oscarish finds the shot, and Smuya, can you deny this bomb plant? He finds the first, and he's looking for the second as well. The challenge not quite in, and the round will be big. He's denied them. The first one to pressure, and it's Tabson on the Krieg to combat it. He's got the timing as well. Control. These players are so hemmed in. Oscarish at the very least able to find one, but Zantares, of course, he trades the Molotov, goes deep, forces Riyats into his crosshairs, but he survives on 5 HP. There's finally some frags to be found for Illuminar, but... They are going to find the advantage before Next trades it down. Two on two with Smuya still in the palace. Make that two on one as Next the bomb. Gets... Pop flash is perfect. Smuya can just peek whenever he wants. There we go. He'll fire. Early peek from Stomp King. Gets something at the very least. But Smuya almost he's immediately. And he's out of there with the AWP. He even hits the shot to take down Stomp King before he's traded out. Zantaris finds another. And it's all on to Riyats and Innocent in the 2-1-2. Two -two. They've managed to find a couple of picks. They've managed to make this look And he get the double spray down. The double peak is good. He gets one. He gets the second as well. Tizian. Oh, my goodness. 13 HP. The rounds. They need something to arrest the momentum of Big. But instead, Tabson's going to get an execution. He's going to get the second as well. Catches off. Cover it. And you can see using so much utility to make that happen as Tizian goes aggressive. Towards Actually might just lose the headshot there. But instead takes the pick onto Stomp King. Of course he does. Last man alive is Innocent. And he spots out Tabson. He wins that aim duel. But he's got three more to find. He's on 72 HP. And Smuya looking to cut things out of the source. We'll find them. as well that this is going to be the split play. Easy frag for Riyats, though. He finds an opening and a oh, second. Lockout underpasses. Oscarish walks right into his awaiting cross. Says he's got one, but he needs more than that. Well, Reset rotations to come in, and Stomp King knows he needs to deal with it. Straight through the box, finds the frag. Four on two now. Smuya and Next, what have you got? Next goes down, and it's all on Smuya. He's had some huge clutches, but he'd need the 1v4 here. He's going to need an awful lot. The flash doesn't blind him, but he can't quite hit the shot. Illuminar will. Hit. Looking in towards underpass. Mono with no idea at all. That's a free frag. And they're going to try and execute towards the same bomb site, but Next is there to find Flash the open. Back. Opens it up perfectly for the M4. Can't quite connect it next, but Zantaris is there to support so many tags. Everybody's low HP. Zantaris gets one, dives back into the cover of Connector. And with Smuya on the top of the stairs, he hits the shot. Last man alive is Oscarish. They're pinning him in, and Zantaris will be the one. Can they push for the victory here? Zantaris wandering in towards CT. One tap to the head, but it's traded by Reitz. And now it's really up to Zantaris on that P250 to take these jewels. But Nex is happy to find one of his own onto Stomp King in towards under. He's trying to buy as much time as he can. How does he get the second there, Nex? It's an absolute demolition. He's got a third as well. On for the 4K, Nex, as Oscarish is just desperately trying to stay alive. He'll find the first, but Zantaris... Steals away the ball. Yeah, able to get one onto Tabson at the very least, but they're tagged up so low as well. Reeks taken down by Zantares. And Oscarish is going to be taken down by Tizian. Time is up. It's all on to Stomp King in the one versus three. He finds the first, but that is all he will get, ladies and gentlemen. It is Big Clan taking.